80 Chivers. <laughs> Producer extraordinaire. Extraordinaire. Um, the end of two very long days. How are you feeling? I'm delighted. I really am. I mean, it's, uh, you know, the four songs were only announced two days ago. So there's no time to prepare. I mean, normally, you know, I'd, I would spend, uh, you know, a couple of days on each track, arranging the track, uh, coming up with ideas for a sort of feel for them. This was thrown in the deep end. I mean, I, um, I semi-worked. I made some notes about three weeks ago of, of all the 24 songs. You know, so, so oh, I'd quite like to do that one. I mean, you know, some, some ideas for that. But uh, I had two right that I thought would go through. Uh, so two was uh, a, a surprise, a, a nice surprise, because they, they actually four really great, great songs. But uh, so uh, I had no idea, to be honest. When I came up here, I thought um, I had some, uh, I've invited some great musicians. So I knew that it was going to be a, a good, a great standard. I knew was, that's in the bag. But only having four hours for each song, you know, um, and starting from scratch, none of them had um, any backing, which I was kind of <laughs> hoping at least one <laughs> would have, um, you know, be in a logic format, so there'd be sort of, I could keep some of the uh, uh, arrangement. But this is all working from scratch. And a lot of the, the processes we've seen, they've actually been organically changing during the sessions as well. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, it's, uh, especially, especially being the songwriter, sometimes you can be a bit precious about, uh, not letting go a lyric or not letting go a certain melody and, and your arrangement and, you know and that they're all sort of fairly young and um, yeah I mean it's but they were completely open I mean the, you know the, the musicians that uh, huddled around um, the, the vocalists the songwriters coming up with ideas um, and uh, working and collaborating like that that's you know, that's how it should be done. But I think also the girls have said themselves that that was part of the most exciting part for them, was actually working and collaborating with such fantastic musicians. Yeah, I mean, the, I, I don't know uh, if they quite realised uh, what an amazing uh, uh, you know, opportunity, but uh, um, place this is. I mean, this is, this is, there's, only, there's only three or four um, studios of this calibre. Um, uh, so... I, you know, I, as the other musicians, most of those wouldn't normally record in a place like this, and they they record all the time. But this is uh, this is high end stuff. You know, it's an expensive studio that uh, you these days you um, you find uh, it's film schools, and it's only films that can afford places like this. You know, but um, no, I think that uh, I think it'll sink in for the the uh, the four girls that came here. Um, probably further down, six months down the line, when they quite realise what an amazing experience. Each and every one of them has said that, and I think one girl put it quite succinctly, that, you know, this is the prize for her. So I think each and every one of them has recognised how special it is, um, but probably not in the whole scope of the music industry. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I mean, I, I think that uh, the competition, um, when we talked about it earlier in the year, you know, we were a bit uh, nervous about you know, not having sponsorship. Um, and not being able to offer a, a, a lot of the other songwriting competitions, um, you know, they're heavily sponsored, and there's, um, you know, it's 25 grand for, yeah. you know, a, a sort of semi-record deal and etc. Uh, didn't have any of this, so we're a little bit sort of worried that, well, what's in it for the, what's in it for them? Kind of forgetting that actually this, yeah. these two days, the four hours that they, they, uh, the four of them had. Uh, I hope that, of course, I hope that they get to, to do again and they, they, they've all become very successful. But, you know, that's, a, of course, yeah. it's not that easy. Um, so for, you know, for at least one of them, if not all four of them, it might be the, the, the best experience they've ever had in their life. You know, they might not be repeated again. Uh, um, and, uh, like I said, there's not many artists that can go and do this sort of thing.